Hi guys, Mysterious Cat Island, back with more Let's Play Star Ocean First Departure. In the last episode, uh, we finally beat Asmodeus. I was salty as fuck about a lot of stuff. A bunch of stuff happened, and now we're on planet Farget to stop some guy who's only just been introduced recently. And, uh, I, fall, I find that some bullshit storytelling things. G.A. Roveris, I believe they, call, they said his name was. So, before we leave the safe house to go save Millie and Fia, who also went missing but no one seemed to notice. Oh good, I can buy stuff. Oh, thank goodness. I am straight up out of so much shit. <laughs> that, uh... Gonna get two of those. Wait don't have any of those things. We don't really need them. Premium paper. Magic camera. What is this? Fatal frame? Ho ho! Oh. That's kinda neat. Fuck it. Let's buy a couple. Got all this fucking money, so. Can I afford to buy 20? Yeah, I can. Let's do it. Let's buy some stuff. I haven't seen anything anywhere else, so. Not that I think we're gonna have any time to actually do any of that stuff, but. Hold on. Sorry about that, guys. Let's see. Oysters, although there's a fish in the picture. Go figure. They haven't done any fucking cooking. Creamy cheese. That'll be supposed to be like brie. Gelatinous slime. Ew. Aspect, you mean? Wobbly. Wobbly? Ingredients of Yarma. Rubier. Hey, these are store HP. Let's fucking take them. Ew! Tomato juice, orange juice, lime juice, and soda water. Blood. Cola, orange juice, and a tetragrenadine. Huh. Maybe. Luxury grape juice. Jesus! Oh yeah, no. I can't, I can't afford that. Cannot afford those. I'm sort of hoping they might have, uh, some, um, da 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 da. Already good on most of these. Witch powder. Okay. Um, weapons and armor, cause, uh, We are missing so much shit. As in, our stuff seems really, uh... Old, in comparison to probably what we should have. It's a Lombo! Oh, Samison. Samison. Aha, they do. Oh my god, what much shit do you guys have? Nothing that's significantly better than what I've got, but. Well, oh, great. Oh, I didn't actually fucking buy any of that shit. God damn it. I'm not gonna go with the cameras, I don't think we need them. One, two. Oh. Two resurrection elixirs. Like, in another playthrough of this, I'll explore some of that some, but. I don't really think it's. This is one of those games where the crafting element's necessary. Don't get me wrong, I like the crafting element in Star Ocean games, but this one's not very intuitive. Um. A lot of the other games, well, I should say a lot, 
But at least in Star Ocean 3, it was pretty easy to f figure out. Go ahead and get a couple of these. I think that was all we needed, honestly. What's a crescent orb? Okay, that doesn't tell me shit. Oh, okay, it's for her. Yes. Thank you. Let's talk to some other people. Bad Goupe? Planet Farget. You sure? Why the fuck not? Okay, that, that's fine. Well, let's buy some skill sets. Oh, we already bought Combat 3. Wow, this really does feel like... Okay, this is supposed to be the final dungeon. Maybe I did buy all the skill sets. Okay. Well, we probably have some skill points to spend. So let's spend a minute doing that. Da, da, da. Yeah, let's go ahead and level up your herbology, because that's a handy thing. Uh, your knife's at 10. We'll do the couple of these. Whistling. Some decks. A little more intelligence. Nice! I don't even use it, but okay. Definitely up the strength. Da, da, da. Concentration. Should be a yeah, yeah. Okay, we've fleshed out our four sacred beast thing that I don't even fucking use. Hooray! Max out your herbology, max out your knife, even though you don't fucking use it. Can't max out your metal science, you just use all your points. Herbology. She's already maxed out knife. Let's go ahead and give you some more mental science. God damn it. Nobody can leave me the fuck alone. Hold on, guys. Sorry about that, guys. Everybody's gonna bother me while I'm recording. That's the way it works, apparently. Uh, let's see... Yeah, let's put a little more in guard break. And the last little bit in power burst. You have none to spend. You have some to defend. I need to put Yashua back in my party, basically. Um. We'll leave you like that. Okay, so I have Yashua in my party. You know what, Ronix? You're fucking coming out of the party. I'm done with you. Mavel girl, I'm sorry I ever stopped putting you in my party. You were way less of a pain in the ass than Ronix. Alright, let's go. <laughs> what? Uh, okay, thanks for the heads up. I'll keep that in mind. Um... Okay, southwest, it's probably this way. May maybe. No, this way? God damn it. This looks like a strong enemy. Oh yeah, more of this shit. Sorry, Yashua Mavel, you guys uh did largely get ignored. Girl, take it easy in your MP there. I'm not made of MP. Even if that makes I count my blessings every day that I am still alive. God damn it. Okay, let's go this one. Oh, that was some glitching shit. Okay. 
We cannot ignore this. Whoa, hey guy. Okay, so but yeah, it seems like I'm pretty well stuck here now. There we go. That's okay. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm having fun with this game, but I'm also to the point where I'm ready to move on. Ready to play other things. Ah, is that it? I think it is. Ready to play other things. Ready to this looks like a strong enemy. I hope we can do this. figure out my next LP is going to be. Because I know I've mentioned it in the Chrono Trigger, but uh, I had a thing planned, but uh, then I found out we were getting a definitive remaster, so I decided to wait till that came out. So, you know, there's that. <laughs> this is great. Okay, evil laughter, Mavelle. Really? Really? This looks like a strong enemy. <laughs> Lightning wolves! They look so they actually look really silly. Look at these big bodies and these teeny tiny little legs. Oh, they're peeing on me. That's That's fantastic. That's that's a great thing. Wow, so I missed a lot of shit on rope, didn't I? I know I missed encounters with at least two characters. Mavel, you're healing them. Thankfully, I'm doing more damage than you are healing. Um. Hmm. That was easy. Thanks in no small part to the distraction Avena's crew is providing for us. The soldiers are probably all gathered by the front entrance. Let's move. We gotta find Millie and the others. Millie and Thea. You got it. That's all we're missing. Like I know it's it's meant to be. Uh, what's through here? There's somebody. It's not Millie or Thea. <laughs> Pink robots! Oh my god. Oh my god, that's some bullshit. That's some crazy damage these guys do. Thank you. It'll hold us a little bit at any rate. There we go. Well, who would have thought? Who would have thought what? Okay, let's see. Nice. No. No, I want the blackberries. There we go. She used all her damn MP so fast. Okay. What's through here? Okay, I can't get through there. Well, I can't open your cell, so... Okay, there's a red door here. There's the green flower door and the blue flower door. Ignore this, can we? It's the moment of truth. Come on, you bastards. Jesus, she's just gonna spam that one spell. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna turn that off, because that's a doctor. Like, she's doing damage at least this time. Okay. Let's see. Special arts. 
Flare was the one she's um We'll just stick with Raven Orb. Death Crystal? What the fuck are you using Death Crystal? Okay. Okay. Push the switch. Yeah, sure. Okay. Hey, chest, nice. Got Mithril, cool. This looks like a strong enemy. I must protect all of us. Thank you, Joshua. You sweet. No, Marvel. Yasha, do you not know any resurrection spells yet? Damn it. Let's see. Because I've got to be the one to do it. I'm sorry. Okay. Hooray. Alright, back the way we came. We'll try here as soon as we can. We're not fucking around for treasure. Ha! Uh, that's a thing's fine. Let's go back the way we came, this real quick. It's the moment of truth. Oh no, bullets. I don't really want to go to the grocery store. Yeah, a little late there. Nice try though, Yashua. Just in time. Raven, Raven, God, that's annoying. She can spam attacks, though. Like, I guess it's kind of a good thing. But it's also kind of an obnoxious thing. Push the switch. Push this switch. Blue door opens. Hey, resurrection mist. Nice. Ooh, I need to switch up some people's stuff. This is tough. We cannot ignore this, can we? No. Now, <laughs> damn, Amelia already needing healing. Oh, come on then. I didn't really need that yet. Oh, I'm gonna have to change up equipment. So no, nah, I'm gonna let you guys go without MP for a little while. Using up all your magic points. Okay, so. Seems like this one should lead me. Hey, you're walking around. I will let you out as soon as I can. I cannot actually open the gates, so. This looks like a strong enemy. This looks tough. Yeah, see, I can spam attacks too. Damn it, Mazel. I love how I'm doing all the resurrecting. There we go. Mavel needs the levels. Yashua needs the levels. Uh huh. Okay, so there's one green one here. Is there a green one through the other door? Oh, 
Oh hey, who are you? You look different. We cannot ignore this, can we? I hope we can do this. No, we we can't ignore this. Thank you. You do good. Hmm. Maybe I'll play another PSP game. Well, shit. Well, now we're all dead. Uh, tactics? Nope. How do I switch? Come on, Ilya, we need you, girl. Thank you. <sighs> Why can't you use items, Yashua? I'm the only fucking person in the goddamn party who knows how to use items. And even that, I barely know how to do. <laughs> okay. We're gonna use food items to recover your MP. Even though it takes way more of them. And we're gonna fix Mavelle's tactics. Save your special arts. There. That will hopefully help. Well, the fact that you're, well, I don't know. Medicine ball. Well, that's okay. I don't really need it. Push the switch. Okay, so that door in the middle hall should be open now, right? I've pressed all the switches. It is! I was right! It's Millie! I missed you, girl! Please come back! Millie, come back! Uh, there we go. I'm gonna say, why are you attacking? I'm pressing the wrong button, that's why. The PSP's controls, like, I had a PSP a long time ago and I have one now. But, uh, I went for a long time without using one, because I just recently repurchased one. Uh. And. Sometimes the controls. Sometimes them controls. Oh yeah, I gotta check on that thing. Maybe I'll play a Sega game. I didn't have a Sega as a kid, but I'm gonna... Fia, Millie! Over here. Millie. And Fia! Like, don't get me wrong, I love Millie, but... Can we get it open? This won't be a problem. Then why couldn't we open the other ones? Came to help us, didn't you? Damn, Fia. I'm sorry, girl. Their hands all over me, those bastards. Oh no! All right. Now let's get out of here while the guards are still distracted. Let's get everybody else out of here while the guards are still distracted too. Hey, glad you're all safe. We really I'm glad that was a mercifully short dungeon. Version, our rescue mission would have been a lot more complicated. Oh, not at all. If anything, I should be the one thanking you. I like your hair. It's fluffy. There's no way any of us could take down Jie, no matter how hard we try. So really, you're our only hope. Hmm. What with the lasers and such? Is it true that optical weaponry doesn't work on Revorce? Yes. Jie is the culmination of everything that Fargate's technology has to offer. Which is why he's a dictator now. Assassination attempts, but all of them were complete failures. Well, why did they build someone so dangerous in the first place? That is a very good question. Fargate is a desolate planet. We have very little water and natural resources to work with. We've been conducting research into genetic engineering and spatial theory for a long time now. It's what we needed to do for survival, and to someday return home to Earth. Home to Earth? Yes. Long, long ago, our ancestors were sent from Earth to Fargate after a meteor strike opened up a spatial vortex in our homeland. Huh! Where have we heard this before? 
Just like the old race was transported to Roke. Unlike Roke, however, Fargate's environment is harsh and inhospitable to human settlement. You're lucky you didn't die on contact. Frustrated in their efforts, our scientists finally decided to turn toward what was then considered forbidden research. They launched a project to create a race of superhumans, people uniquely adapted to life on our planet. Huh. I wonder if it was a possibility that Asmodeus could have been one of them. Genetic engineering on humans? Yes. And the result of that project is the superhumans, including GA. Their combined muscular, nervous, and brain systems make them uniquely adapted to cope Although, with the severities Although, the fact that the laser swords worked on him, and should not apparently work on this guy. However, the core they were built from is still human. The genes that define all of us. Yeah, but we share 60% of our DNA with bananas, so... They are not immortal. You could say that's their sole weakness. Hmm. The building blocks of life are pretty consistent across the life. The only chance we have of killing Revorce. Hmm. Most of the army is off in outer space, participating in the Earth invasion. As leader, however, Gia would never leave the planet voluntarily. With most of his guard away, sneaking into Revorce Tower, where he resides, is a distinct possibility. He named his tower after himself. What a what a fuck boy. When the army is already on the move. Revorce Tower is located in Vadgoop, our capital. Vadgoop. You'll find it north of here. There's a great big cliff in the way, though, so reaching it on foot is impossible. So how will we get there? Jetpacks, right? North of Vadgoop, there's an old, closed-off laboratory. A biolab, to be exact. Great! There should be an underground corridor below the lab that connects directly to Revorce Tower. I love to do dungeons before dungeons. But hopefully it's still in service. Well, it beats storming the place head on, I guess. All right, let's head to the bio lab. Well, we're not fucking doing it right now, though. All right, guys. <coughs> well, I'm gonna have to end the episode here this time. We'll pick it up in the next one. And uh, God, we probably only have another four episodes or so based on the way they're talking about all this stuff. So, but thanks for watching. We'll pick it up next time. Bye.